Hey everyone, I'm Lacey from the Mount St. Helens Institute. We here at the Mount St. Helens Institute are committed to breaking the barriers to accessing Mount St. Helens. Barriers include financial constraints, limited transportation, the knowledge and skills to access Mount St. Helens, and the skills and capacity to engage in the outdoors. There are many benefits to exposing children to nature at a young age. These include increased ability to concentrate, improved academic performance, reduced stress and aggression levels, and reduced risk of obesity. There are significant links between the development of lifelong environmental attitudes and values with experiences in nature. Mount St. Helens Institute is committed to fostering youth's reconnection to nature, as well as to build environmental concern across race, ethnic, and socioeconomic boundaries. Staff at the Mount St. Helens Institute are just a few examples of how important it is to expose children to nature at a young age. Our childhood experiences have shaped the men and women that we've become today. Here are some of our stories. I grew up in the industrial district of Milwaukee, Wisconsin. We actually had a little tiny yard, and in that yard there was a juniper tree, and the branches hung down over the edges, and I loved to crawl inside where they touched the ground and climb up and sit in the lower branches because I was completely surrounded by green. I grew up in Ohio in the Midwest and my grandmother had a big piece of land that had this big hill and then a creek that ran up behind it. And my favorite memory is being barefoot in this creek. It, had, it shaped my appreciation for the outdoors. Every summer my family and I would drive up to Whidbey Island, Washington where my great aunt and great uncle lived. I'd be looking for sand dollars, I'd be walking next to boats that were tied up to buoys that were not just resting on the ocean bottom. And it was just this great experience to explore this unknown world that was now exposed. My first memories were really on summer vacations up in Michigan. And there was an older retired woman there uh, named Marge, and she loved taking all of the kids on these nature hikes. So one of my memories is actually playing, just playing with my sister, and it was by this creek, and there was a tree that grew right next to the creek, and the roots came out and kind of formed a balcony, and it was this magical place that my, me and my siblings used to go. You know, it was just my own little secret spot that I found that was beautiful and had its magic please visit www.mshinstitute.org backslash give to donate today. Together, we really can break the barriers to accessing Mount St. Helens and give children the opportunity to create memories in nature. Thank you.